everyone, I'm Ashok. Welcome to another video on Machine Learning Data Science Terminology Series. In this video, we look at what is SMART. All right, SMART stands for Synthetic Minority Oversampling Technique. Technique. Okay, what is it? It's used to balance out the data set. So what do you mean by balancing? Well, if you have a data set with let's say two classes, uh, let's say I have a data set which has uh, a banking data set, for example. So the data set contains a um, uh, uh, number of people who have defaulted in a loan. We say default is your target variable. That has one and um, paid back non-default which is actually zero okay so the data set might have let's say you take a thousand records of which uh, 50 people have defaulted and 950 people have paid back so these are the defaults okay these are one class and this is a zero class this is one default class this is a zero class which is paid back this is an example of your imbalanced data set because you see that the majority class has significantly more number of data when compared to the minority class over here. This is your minority class. So why it is a problem? Well, if you train most of the machine learning algorithms, they tend to bias towards the majority class. But I would like to find the defaulters. So the, mo the motive of this machine learning algorithm is finding out who would be defaulting so that I don't give a loans to them. All right. So, but my model tends to towards the majority class for simple reason, because the model goal is to maximize the accuracy. If it simply says every record or non-default, then even if it says default is also non-default, still it will have 95% accuracy because that's a majority class. Okay. So if you, if you, if you give it 10,000 new data, for example, you have a thousand new data for this trained model and your model is so biased, whatever you give it to it, it is going to say that uh, they are non-defaulters or they will pay it back. Good people. All right. Out of this thousand records, let's take a similar example. So let's say out of this thousand records, we have about 60 members who are defaulters or probable defaulters and we have 940 members who probably pay back. But your model is going to say all thousand will pay back zero class and zero members actually default if you calculate the accuracy how we how is how, we, how do you calculate accuracy it's the rightly predicted data divided by the total data the rightly predicted data 940 or non-defaulters so you say 940 are correct and then total data is thousand you'll end up getting 94 percentage right so model has an every in incentive to bias towards your majority class because the goal of many machine learning models, most of the machine learning models is to maximize this accuracy and by biasing towards a majority class, you maximize the accuracy. So that's the reason most of the models bias towards the majority class. And what we do in SMART is by normalizing it. How do you normalize? Well, we create new data. Let's say these are your um, non-defaulters or the people who are paying back the loan, good ones. And these are your defaulters, few of them. So what we do is we try to extrapolate or interpolate. Basically, you try to average this and create new data. It's a fake data or generated data. So we create new records by just averaging the red red data, which has a red class. And thereby, we try to match. So basically, this 50 records of your red class will be, you know, averaged over and over and make it 950 and your majority class is anyway 950 stay as 950 the total records you'll be having is 1900 so uh, and it's properly balanced because both the classes are 950 because you are generating data by averaging synthetically because it's a fake data or synthetic data we call it as synthetic minority because we are taking the sampling of minority 
oversampling. We are actually oversampling. We are making the 50 to 950, which is oversampling technique called as SMOT. I have another video which explains the oversampling in more detail, the SMOT technique in more detail. Also run it through a, a proper Python uh, use case, a, a proper data and show how SMOT can improve an accuracy. So I'll leave the uh, link of that video in the description. You can watch it for more details. So in this video, SMOT is a, a, a balancing technique for an imbalanced data set and it's called a synthetic minority oversampling technique. All right, that's it. If you like this channel, if you like this channel, please subscribe and click notification. If you have any questions, you can post it on the comments. I'll be more than happy to answer them. And um, thank you. I'll see you in the next video.